Welcome back, everybody. I have already got people walking into my big bits. Welcome back to Mega Aquarium. It's so wet this weekend, but if you listen very carefully behind me, there's probably more watery sound effects going on outside my window than in this game, but no funky music. So I've got to get 160 stars, and I have 120 at the moment, so I just need a few more tanks because my resource points are just about holding steady. Just got to remember how to do it now. So in the last episode, I created myself a little staff bit. So I'm thinking a load more tanks along here and then the staff can get in behind. That makes sense to me. So what I need is a wall tank. Um, and I don't know how big I can make them. Not that big in the grand scheme of things. We'll put one there, and we'll put one there, and we'll put one there, and I'm going to need a bit of wall because you know very well, in fact no, I'll have a staff door. The public will get in, and we don't want the public to get in. So, I now need to get my bulldozer out and just get rid of a bit of this. And actually I don't need another staff door because why would they need a door into that bit? They can go through anyway. Don't even need a wall. Not the best use of space, not going to lie, but... I will put in a tool station and I will put in some filters. So I now have pump, combi, mini. In the last episode I was trying to work out how on earth you use a pump to connect tanks up to seven tiles away. But instead I think I will just go with the old combi. There we go. So, that gives me about 40 fish points or something. I'm slowly but surely starting to work this out, just not very well. I can't remember what fish I've already got. What do I fancy? Flame angel fish. They cannot be housed with stony corals, clams or gorgonians, god help you. I don't know, what have I already got? I suppose I should all look, really. So I've got some, uh, I've got some orange fish. I think they're flame angel fish, aren't they? And I've got some red and yellow thingies and I've got the yellow ones there and I've got an eel and I've got some pink ones and some white ones and some blue ones oh man probably haven't got enough types of fish now so I think I've got all of these have I? should we put some royal grammar in? I've just realised actually they don't need plants what do they need? You'd think they would need plants, but they don't. So fine, I will put some of those in then. How many can I get away with? Lots. Ten? Oh. Somebody didn't like that then. What's the problem? Is it just because the tank doesn't look very good? Right, that's the maximum number of fish. And their water quality is a little bit rubbish. So if I get um, some rubble. Put some rubble in. Has that helped? that help at all? Yes. There we go. Lovely. And they like orange pellets. Where is my food? I always get confused with the icons in this. I don't know why. Where is my food? There we go. Orange pellet dispenser. Oh, somebody's already bringing some orange pellets though. Do I need another one? Put one in anyway. I, it's not like I can't afford it, is it? Actually, I very nearly can't afford it. So now I'm sort of still hovering around the 17, 18, 19. In fact, it's going down. Damn it! <laughs> I thought that putting more fish in was a good thing. You dumped that food in there. There we go. Right, I might be able to just about afford some benches so that people can sit and watch the, the old orange fish. There we go. Woohoo! Can I put a gift shop in? That's all I'm really that interested in. Gift shops, toilets, food. None of that seems to have been unlocked yet. Lots of people sitting down. Should have a tunnel of tanks. <gasps> Wonder if you can have an actual tunnel. That would be awesome. I'm sure there's much about this game that I have not yet actually realised. But my points have gone down now. That's not good. I need unique combinations of animals and decorations. Is that what it is? I mean, look, they're having a great time. 
Maybe it's because I haven't got unique combinations. I think I might be able to get one or two more fish in here because I upped the water quality. So, is there anything that can live in rubbishy water quality? This blue one. Oh no, I've hit my maximum fish, haven't I? Oh, I won't do that then. Put some in here instead. And a uh, blue one. There's a blue one. Oh, it needs some plants. Good, because I like plants. I'll give you some sea grapes. And I'll give you some lettuce. There we go. Awesome. Pop. Another two in there. And then I would have thought that pretty much anything would live with them. So we'll pop some unique combinations in. Maybe a couple of pink ones? Can I have a couple of pink ones? Yes. It looks like I can. Good. Right. So what's the problem? Why do people not like... Is it because there's nothing in it? Oh, hang on a minute. I accidentally... Oh, I've accidentally put some in here. I didn't mean to do that. I've accidentally put some in the other tank. Whoops. Oh, I'll give them some eelgrass because why not? I'd like a bit of eelgrass. Right. Are we happy now? Probably not. What can I put... L what else can I put in here? Does that... Dislikes lights? I don't think any of my tanks have lights. May or may not eat or damage crustaceans. There's no crustaceans in there, in fairness. How about tangy things? This tank's temperature must be equal or greater to its... Whatever that is. Getting more and more confusing fish, that's the problem. Let's shove some of those in there. There we go. Are we good now? I don't even know. I'm back at 122 though, look. Oh, it's going up. It's going up. It presumably has to be unique combinations. You think I need another member of staff, incidentally? Oh, actually, it won't let me. Romeo is idle. Well, in that case, definitely not. Look, I've gone up to 135. This is good. It's working. The little staff door's getting used there. What's this? 121... Is that ecology points? Yes. Hey, look, they're loving it. They're loving it. They're loving it. <gasps> going up, going up, going up, up, up. Because my tanks are all unique. Well, no, they're just a mess. Or it is a mess of fish. I'm so nearly there. I'm so nearly there. This is ridiculous. <gasps> look how close. What if I just put one more fish in somewhere? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, come on! Yay! Loads of money! Impressive work on the latest expansion. You've proven you're ready for even more advanced aquarium design techniques. Oh, God. It's time to learn about pumps. They allow me to remotely locate my equipment away from my tanks. Instead of attaching your heaters, filters, etc. directly to your tank, you attach them to the pump. Oh, I see. So it's like, it's like the water pipe in SimCity. 2000. Do you remember the water pipe in SimCity 2000? Right. Demonstrate your understanding of pumps by building a pump and a tank confederation matching the specification in your objectives. Okay. Build a lagoon tank. Lagoon tank? That sounds amazing. Look, I've got a lagoon tank. <gasps> is that going to be like... Oh, is that, the... is that the biggest it can be? Really? I was expecting that to be gigantic. Anyway, I need to build a pump at least three tiles away. I'm sure I can do that. So, there's a pump. And then one, two, three, four. That's four tiles away, yeah? And then connect it. <gasps> I've done it, I've done it, I've done it, I've done it. Any animal, sufficient water quality. I mean, don't <laughs> the thing is, yeah, they can see it now, can't they? So I'm just going to quickly build a wall around that because that looks really ugly. <laughs> uh, excuse me, would you mind not... Not being in my area. <laughs> Get out of my area, Darren. That's a staff area. Get out of my area. No, no, don't walk back into the area. Oh, no. I've made the area too popular. Oi. There's nothing over there other than a pump. I've got to master the pump. Get out. That's the way. Staff door. Ah, <laughs> you're not getting back in. There we go. Right, good. So, need to put some fish in it. 
and I need to connect equipment to the pump. So presumably, if I just put in a power combi like there next to the pump, well, I could put two in. Two. Two next to the pump. There we go. Okay. And then I put in some... I mean, I feel like the eel kind of needs a lagoon. The eel lagoon. It sounds good to me, anyway. So, I give it some grass and I give it a cave. In fact, I could give it two caves. Yeah? Okay. And then we get an eel. I'll pop it in there. Is it good? It's good! Oh! Vending machines! Yay! If you missed it, yesterday I was talking about how I bought a tiny little sweet vending machine from Japan Centre, which is very exciting. And I went a bit vending machine mad in the uh, last episode of the the uh, hospital game. So, can I put this down here somewhere? If I put it there, are they going to be able to get at the pumps? I'm going to assume so. There we go. Oh, but vending machines, right. Excellent. Let's do it. We'll put one there. And we'll put one there. And we'll put one there in the sort of sort of seating area. That feels like where a school party might go. That's awesome. And then I need to reach rank four. I'm sure I can do that now that I've got vending machines. I mean, I could put another lagoon in, possibly. I don't know. I'm quite excited about it all. I've wasted so much space, you'll notice. <laughs> oh, dear. I've got a huge staff bits and not actually that many tanks. I feel like I should be thinking about my design a little bit more. It's just a thought. I mean, I could have corridors, couldn't I? I could have a corridor leading out here. Ooh! One of my guests has thrown their fizzy drink litter on the ground. Build a broom stat, for God's sake. Bloody guests. Now, does the stand have to be in the area because if it does I'll just I'll just pop it there where nobody's really paying any attention I can reduce the amount of time that my staff spends sweeping after my guests by placing bins I will be placing bins I am disgusted I was tweeting the other day about the state the absolute state that people leave beaches in when they've been to beaches very annoying it's very unfair on everybody and the environment so don't do it kids please right anyway look I'll put bins in corners so that people don't really have to see them very much. They're not very expensive, are they? Look, I've got I've won something here. Oh no, I haven't. <laughs> right, so the points are going down again. So I need to have a proper think about this because I don't think that I've really taken this very seriously. So if I've got an equipment area here and one here, then it would make sense to use. Maybe this bit? So, if I expand all this... And then what I will do... Is make this into a corridor. Oh, invalid placement location. Okay, maybe not then. There? Yeah, okay. Then I'll take a bit out. So that I can put a flappy door in, if I can remember where flappy doors are. There. Like that. And while I'm building this, we'll just keep that a staff only area. But I could now make that a not staff only area. So if I pick this up and pop it perhaps on this wall here. And I pick this up. I'm so used to picking up and dragging. Get confused. Right, pop that there. And then we'll put a wall in next to those sort of here, like that. And we'll put a flappy door in there. And we will remove that little bit of wall. Actually, there's two little bits of wall. Like so. And then, actually, I could what I could do is take out all of this wall as well and put some extra tanks in. I know I've just put that wall in. 
I've had a rethink. So if I get what lagoon tanks or wall tanks? We get wall tanks and put them in. I need a bit of corridor, don't I? So what about what about there? Can the staff get in? I think the staff can get in. There and there and a little one there and then build wall there and there and there and move that whoop i keep trying to pick it up can't pick it up move it what there i don't think they can use that door actually if i do that how about up here up there and then actually let me move that kind of like there so it's a bit out of the way does that make sense i think that makes sense I hope that makes sense. And then what I can do is delete the flappy door and the wall. And put some benches in. Along here. And put a vending machine there. And bin there. I've just realised, actually. I don't think I can do that. <laughs> actually, I can't because well, what I kind of have to do is attach all of the all the pump things. Damn it! <laughs> I didn't realise. Oh, I made a mess of that. Ah, sorry, kids. I'm just gonna have to move these, which is fine because I can do that. Except now there's a bin in the way of the view. No viewable locations for guests. That's okay. I'll just put it I'll leave it there for the time being don't judge me I've realized what I'm trying to do I've just I just haven't put like filters in I'm assuming I don't need to use pumps all over the place do I I know what you're supposed to do you're supposed to like put all of your equipment together aren't you and then link it all up um is that what Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Did you see that link up then? I don't think I've quite understood how pumps link. But that was quite exciting. What if I if I put a pump there, right? And into there. What what have we got now? <laughs> I don't even know. Have I got quality? Is there any water quality going on? Is it gonna tell me? Forty or fifteen. 40 or 15, those haven't really got anything. Uh dear. I've done what is commonly known as mess this up. <laughs> oh dear. no don't no don't put it back. I don't want it back. No 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 no. Don't don't do that. I need to delete it. Get rid of that. Oh, I've made a mess of it. My design is all wrong! Right, so that's that, that is powering this this pump this tank but not this one and I'm assuming I don't want them sh being shared do I so let's get rid of that for a moment oh sell that just for a moment sell all of that oh god get a wall in before they start wandering in you know what they're like bye Ooh, right okay so have I got some water quality in one of these now? Yes. So what I can do is put in some rocks, maybe? And some lettuce. And we'll put in some of the fish that don't really want anything. Is that okay now? Is that good? Have I done have I done done a good thing? I think I've done alright. And I'll put in something else that doesn't really want plants, maybe. They all want plants, that's the problem. Damn you. Some of you want a lot of plants, that's no good. Right, fine. I'll put some blue ones in, right? And then I will put in another lettuce. So that should hopefully make everybody happy. Oh, not happy. Why not happy? Excuse me, why are you not happy? I'm getting bored of seeing Azure Demoiselle. Well, whatever. <laughs> right, no more of those then. No more bluefish. So what am I going to put in here? 
that isn't bluefish? That's the question. I mean, technically, I'd probably get away with just putting a mini thing in, shouldn't I? Don't need a power combi on everything. There we go. We can still get round it at the moment. So, if I'm not allowed to put bluefish anymore, how about these ones? These need lots of plants, though. Like, lots of plants. So, we'll give you some grapes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, loving it. Loving it. Look. Very, very, very happy. I feel like one or two others should probably go in as well. How about a pink one? I'm trying to put a fish into this woman's head. Actually, hang on a minute. It's her. It's the woman through the American football team. Rapino. It's Megan Rapino. Hello. Please do not dump your sports bottle on my floor. Well, it's very nice of you to come. Are you going to put that in the bin? Being the model of society that you are? Yes. Good. Oh, that's exciting. Actually, her name's Scarlet, but you know. Right, let's get one of these benches moved. We'll just have a little sort of seating area. Oh, Megan's back to tell you to put your rubbish in the bin. It's very important to... <clears throat> okay, right, uh-oh. <gasps> Is that because it's being fixed? You better not be killing my fish. I'm going to get mad. Anyway, this thing is now huge. But 193 out of 220. That's not bad. I mean, this is like the worst designed aquarium in the whole world, but I do feel like I am roughly doing the right thing. It's just that I need to get around the concept of having a plant, as in, <laughs> as in all the tank equipment together, not a plant like in a big box and then having tanks all the way around it potentially there's a thought right have i got the money i actually have a message zebra Mire eel 2 has grown oh man really that's probably not a great thing but mind you it is in the lagoon tank or is it is it in there oh it's there it's hiding they do they do that okay right so i need to start thinking about this don't i I need, like, a load of tank equipment here, and then I can build tanks. Although, actually, wouldn't even need to do that, would I? Um, hmm. I'll put that in anyway. Because the whole, I think so the whole point is the, the lagoon tanks, isn't it? So what if I put a lagoon tank in here but had the equipment there? Or a lagoon tank here but with the equipment there? Lagoon tank. Oh no, because it's actually got to be in the thing. Hang on. Right. Lagoon tank would have to be, like, here. Put a huge lagoon tank in there and then get a pump like here next to this power combi and then I link my pump into the tank is that right click to connect is that right yeah yeah is that okay is that working now do I need more than one combi Yes, okay. So now I need to take away... Oh hang on a minute, to take away the wall, this is so stupid. You have to create a new room, that which makes no sense to me at all, but anyway. Right, so that tank is now being powered from somewhere else, the somewhere else being behind this wall. I'm just experimenting with it, I don't really know what I'm doing. So they still need to be able to get in to feed stuff, don't they? Okay, right. <laughs> it's not okay. Am I supposed to be researching anything else, incidentally? No. Okay, right. Well, they're going to get sick of stuff. The thing is, they're going to get sick of seeing things, aren't they? <laughs> Let's get some of the rarer things in. So, how about yellow tangs? 
What do they need? They need green food. And they need lots and lots and lots of plants. Okay. Let's see if I can do that then. Uh, ah, plants. So if I give them some grapes... I think somebody's enjoying it. Not enough money. Uh oh. <laughs> that ain't good. Right. That's not good because I now can't buy fish food. How much is fish food? 200 thingies. I don't have 200 thingies, damn it. You might have to bring green pellets in from somewhere else. Right. I understand the concept. I've just completely messed everything up by not understanding it earlier. But they do seem to like the new room. Look at that. Pop, 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 pop. Your donations will feed these fish. There we go. Lovely. I'm assuming they can move... They can use these tools for this tank because there's a door? Maybe not. Well, there's not even a door. There's just a gap. Whoop! It's day 27! I'm only on 170 of 220. That's not good. Oh, here come some green things. I've built you a green thing container now. Do you see what people think? This is Yvonne. She's already seen Yellow Tang. This is Emily. She really likes Yellow Tang. She's already seen some other things. Damn it! The thing is, I have a limited number of fish. What else could I put into here that they might like that people haven't seen before. I don't use rocks very often. Not that they need them. Oh, <coughs> excuse me. Choke him. On my own fish. <laughs> Do they want some more grapes? There we go. wonder what I haven't used. Black bar soldier fish. Cannot be housed in a tank with lights attached. Needs a cave. I wonder if it would fit in there. Should we try? Unless you can pop one in with the eel, of course. Ah, maybe they like being in with the eel. Should we try it? Are you going to eat each other? Please don't eat each other. I mean, that's a big tank, incidentally, so you'd think. Might even be able to put an eel in there as well. Come here, public. I have things for you. Anybody? <laughs> Nobody interested? This is really annoying. <laughs> Been open for a month, though. We, aren't, we haven't died yet, so that's something. Ah, those fish eat orange pellets, so I might need to put some orange pellets in closer. Although, somebody's brought some, which is very kind of them. Right, what do you think, guys? What do you think? Oh, I'm loving it. Oh, <gasps> not enough caves! Not enough caves, that's bad. Where can I put another one in? There, in the corner. Right, are we happy now? Anybody? Are people not coming into this bit because it hasn't got a vending machine? <laughs> that's all you're interested in. Oh, somebody didn't like something. Already seen royal grammar. Really likes that... Does your demoiselle, you're not having it, so don't get any designs on it, Seb. Right, how we doing? <gasps> Looks good, yeah. That's got me a few points, I think. What do you reckon, Seb? Already seen Royal Ground, we already know that, we already know that. However, look, I'm just not getting enough stars, am I? It's because it's a crap aquarium. <laughs> That's the only real reason. Coral groupers. I do have some coral groupers, I'm sure. Cannot be housed with coral grouper. That's a bit concerning. I already have two. Growth time. It's greedy. 
Maybe I should just leave things for a while and hope that I get enough stars. I mean, they're loving it down here. I'm still convinced I need some more staff, but I'm not... Oh, hang on. Sven. Sven has turned up. Having said that, Romeo is idle. Romeo's always idle. Is Romeo actually doing anything or is he trapped somewhere? Oh, no, there we go. <laughs> is it worth getting Sven? I think I just accidentally cancelled Romeo's job there. I didn't mean to do that. Is it worth getting Sven in? Oh no, Claire's now idle, so not quite enough work. Not quite enough work. Right, I said I'd get some orange things for down here. So they don't have to be carried. There we go. I'm getting loads of ecology points. But not really much in the way of um, whatever that is. <laughs> Respect. This corridor is uh, very much respected. I've now got 198 out of 220 and it is climbing quite considerably so hopefully... Oh no, it's gone back down again. Oh, I hate you! Trapped. That's really irritating. I thought I was going to do it but I'm not going to do it, am I? Damn it! These people are buying my stuff. It's all it's important ultimately, isn't it? Oh, I'm gonna need more tanks. Whoop! It's day 30, so um right, I've got room for another tank down here. And obviously I've got a huge room up here, so if I put another I don't know, a corner tank? I put a corner tank in? I put a corner tank in with a wall and a flappy door. Haven't really got enough room for anything there, have I? Maybe not then. Move it up a bit. Right, can people get in there? Yes, they can still get in there. Not for much longer. Right. So, if I put in the old power combi. I don't think it needs a power combi, actually. I think it just needs a mini combi. Okay, it probably needed a pack. How about two? Move it two in? Yes. And then if I put a tool station. And then I get some coral grouper. Ooh, uh oh. Oh no. Fish death, fish death, fish death. Oh man, it's care requirements are not being met. No, blah, blah, blah. It needs somewhere to hide. I will give you caves, I will give you caves, please don't die. Thank you. Right, they eat red stuff. Oop, I keep getting that wrong. I want it that way around. Thank you. The toolbox is a little smiley face. Actually, it's a bit of a disturbed face. <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe how crap you are. <laughs> right, what are they whinging about? What's the problem? Because that looks awesome to me. Right, they've got a hiding place. Water quality. Uh, another coral grouper is present. That's not good. Can we get rid of it? Oh. Um, what if I just want to get rid of a coral grouper? Can I just sell it? Is that okay now? I think they just like to be in pairs. I think grouper is not correct. Right, so water quality is good, hiding's good, temperature's good, science points. Right, I think that's now okay. I really hope that's now okay. It's not doing anything though, is it? I like plants, so they can bloody well have some lettuce, even if they don't want it. Right, we're good now? We're good now? Yeah, yeah. Oh, this is so frustrating. I want to flatten the whole thing and start again because I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> but somebody really doesn't like. What's it? I really like the grouper. Like the grouper. Like the like the right. What's what's the problem then? Why are you giving me negative respect? Oh, Megan. 
Megan's back. Megan likes fish. <laughs> Is that deliberate? Do you think they put her in the game deliberately or was it always like that? Not quite sure that Megan quite knows what she's doing here. <gasps> right, are you going now, Megan? Have, have you had enough? I've had enough as well. Oh, she's gone into the corridor. I'm just not getting enough respect. Clearly, I'm not doing something right, am I? Standard. I mean, there's respect everywhere, it's just not enough of it. They're not very happy, are they? Why are you not very happy? Oh, Growth time cannot grow until requirements are fulfilled. No, I think it's because there is, m there are too many groupers, basically. So I will get rid of another one. Right, are we okay now? Fishies. No, we're still not okay. You'd only have one in a tank. I mean, seriously, what's, what is that about? Right, we'll get rid of that as well. You're on your own now. Are you happy? No. <laughs> Oh my god. Right. Coral grouper number four. The thing is, I, I don't... I don't think I'm... I hadn't realised that I'm not actually taking it out, am I? This is the thing is, I don't want to put it anywhere else. Where else could I put it if they want hiding places? Should I just shove it in with the eel? See if it's okay. Because it might not be okay. The eel might eat it, but... Right, now, right. Now it's happy. Are you happy now? Yeah? Happy now. Plenty of respect for you now, but cannot grow until all requirements are fulfilled. So, there's a science point issue here, is there? Or is this just no feeding? It missed its last feeding. It missed its last feeding. Why did it miss it? Is this because my staff are too busy? Or, no, my staff are not too busy. Is it because they can't get at the tank? Uh oh. I don't want to starve it to death, do I? That would be very bad. But they can get in, can't they? So, hang on a minute. Let's get... Ver let's very, very quickly get rid of one of these. I'll just shove it anywhere for the time being. Doesn't matter. Uh, no, I want to sell it. Oh, hang on. No, I need to bulldoze it. Right, get rid of that. Get rid of that. I'm going to put the power thing in instead. More power to you, fishy. Are you good now? Uh, it's just not being fed. Which is really bad. And I feel I feel bad for you, fishy. I'm, I'm not fully sure why you're not being fed. Let's hire Sven. See whether he does anything. Is that you, Sven? No, that's Richard again. That's the guest Richard. Okay. Right, I don't know what I've done wrong there. I'm very confused about everything generally. I mean, I've got a flappy door so the staff can get in and I've got the right kind of food. This task is now important. Oh! Oh, now you're flying in with your food after I did my completely unnecessary adjustments. How is it now? Happy now? Yes! Right, good, okay. Good, great. in some benches here just for the tired <laughs> I'm tired as well right I'm gonna give up here because this aquarium is a complete and utter mess and is not earning enough respect for me to move on if you have any suggestions about how I might be able to earn enough respect because you would won't you don't know what that means to me <clears throat> then please let me know in the comments but I will see you in the next episode when hopefully I will get these unappreciative idiots to respect my fish!